what type of encouragement can you leave with our listeners out there today? Something I, I always, I'll, I always walk, I always like to throw this out there because I wish I'd have heard it when I was a boy. Um, don't ever let someone else's perception of you become your reality. And when somebody's on you hard and telling you you're, you can't do this or you're, or you're this, that, and the other, that's their opinion. Mm-hmm. You know, don't let that become your reality. If you don't do that, you can be, you can do anything you put your mind to. And then that, that, that's this. I tell my boys that every time I, um, we have a conversation with somebody that's picking on them or, or talking ugly to them. I was like, don't ever let what anybody else says say about you define you. Mm-hmm. Because chances are you're never going to see them again. So why would you hang on to that? Yeah, you know, one thing I've learned is that, you know, you can't really, you know, what what somebody thinks of you, you can't really. I, and I know I've always been that guy because I'm a people pleaser and I've always wanted to be a people pleaser. And, and now I, I've kind of. Change, uh, change that perspective on my life and my life. You, can't, you can't make everybody happy. I try the same. I'm like, you want to try as hard as I can to please it. And it, it, it just can't. And it, if you carry that weight around with you, it just make it make you sick. Oh yeah, absolutely. And again, you're an honorable man. You're taking on a job that let's, uh, let's face it. Nobody wants to do. It's a hard job. You're going to get beat up. Whether you go in there, if you go in there and do a great job, you're going to get beat up. If you go in there and do a horrible job, you're going to get praised and beat up. If you go in there and do, it's like, it doesn't matter. Like, whatever's going to happen, you're going to have 50% that loves you, 50% that hates you. You're like, okay, I'm in there trying to work on behalf of the country here to make it all a better place for you and me. And 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 it's like, your opinion Yes, it matters to me, but I can't hold on to that because if I hold on to it, like you said, it's going to make you sick. And and we need, you know, a guy in there who's going to be healthy mentally and, and physically to make the hardest decisions, you know, for, uh, you know, for our country moving forward. And I know we've got the, the, the right man for the job at this certain time right now in our nation's history. 